Well, thank you very much indeed for asking me to provide my thoughts from 12 months ago, the very first TEDx Bollington. It, it was, of course, a great privilege to be part of that event. And um, uh, just to encapsulate that, I've worn exactly the same shirt as I did on that day. Um, so what do I most remember about that day? Um, well, not a great deal. <laughs> um, obviously there was the, the great teamwork, the coming together of, of everyone, but I think for me it was the rehearsals that were more memorable, more memorable now to me, and seeing people grow into uh, the required confidence to present on stage, uh, the great mentoring we had in order to do that. I, I think the stories um, are more impressive on the lead up to the event, because on the event we just had to deliver, <laughs> deliver, deliver. Uh, of course, uh, this was um, a really memorable part of the day for me. It wasn't just my talk, it was the entire visual branding of the event. I was extremely proud of doing that as well. So, um, so yeah, that was very, very memorable for me. What has changed for me since that day? Um, good question. Let me think about that. Nothing, nothing has changed. For me, um, did I want anything to change for me? Then, yeah, maybe I did. Um, it would have been nice. To be honest, uh, I remember the second day after the tour, I felt really empty. And I think it was probably because leading up to the tour, such a lot of effort and motivation was put into that talk um, that you know, I just felt quite empty uh, after it. But I did have people stop me on the streets here in Bollington um, for you know a couple of weeks after that event and uh, that was heartening because I think people were very genuine and very kind about my talk. Going back to the previous question, what do I remember most about the day? I'd just like to say I could have done it so much better. It was a bit of a jumble, a bit of a jumble. at the start, but then it eventually got into a flow. Anyway, do I think that the theme of my talk is more relevant now than it was then? 100% yes, it most certainly is. And the coronavirus pandemic has, um, has been the reason for that. Uh, there's no greater time that we should be noticing what is special around us when we're in, you know, uh, confined um, environments, that is absolutely key to go out and listen and look and feel um, what is special about our everyday environment. We've got to do that in order to to to, to bring ourselves up and. Um, appreciate what's around, it, right around us. Right around us. And most definitely, I personally have done that, even more so than ever before. So my goodness, yes, my talk is 100% more relevant now than it was then. I really hope people can perhaps revisit it, or if they haven't seen it, go and look at it. I hope it encourages people to, to see the positivity in um, the everyday because it's there. We're not very good at seeing that positivity and um, hopefully my talk can just encourage people to do that. Have a great day.